if you want to laugh your ass off, you know? It's just like one of those classic old-fashioned comedies and it deserves to have the classic old-fashioned treatment of just like make a day of it, a night of it, go with your friends. Oh my God, he should be excited. He is a superstar. Really proud to be able to take credit for discovering him. Not me alone, but us. <laughs> It's wild. I've been very emotional about it all day and, and sort of continue to be. Like, this is a, an absolutely surreal thing. I love this movie so much. I can't wait to see it. I can't wait for people to see it. And to see people see it, like, it's going to be fun. It's going to be really, really fun. Jennifer Lawrence, uh, I had a terrible time with. Um, no, we, she's like one of my best friends. And, and that was sort of the great surprise and delight and gift of working on this besides just how great the movie is and how much I love his character and the story is that I now have like somebody who's, who's going to be in my life forever who I talk to pretty much every day. I think people are going to get a lot of joy from No Hard Feelings. I, I think the big goal of, for our, us is that people laugh and not forget their problems but like get to laugh at their problems and sort of like commune about them with everybody. Um, my character Percy, he's a very antisocial person. He's very afraid of the world in a very particular way to my generation. Um, and so I think that we haven't seen a character like Percy in a comedy uh, and in a big movie. And I, I hope that people people resonate with, with him. I think they will. Oh, it's such a fun summer movie, even though we shot it in fall and winter. Um, it is like beaches and... and cars and like it's a huge summer comedy there's nothing better than like hot summer day afternoon get a couple drinks sit in an air-conditioned theater and laugh your butt off with your friends like that's that's what this is here for it has to be seen in a theater you can't do the thing where you're sitting on your couch you're half watching and you're like breathing out through your nose every time there's something funny like this is a movie for you to come and laugh and have fun with people, with strangers, with people you know and love. It's a great date movie. Like it's it's for you to come and, and see and, and love. The very first time I read the script, it was like, yeah, that's the funniest script I've I've ever read. I'm not that I'm like the arbiter of good scripts. But um, I, I knew I needed to do it and only ever got better. On the day, Gene and John, our writers would be throwing things out, like it's, it's, they made the movie they set out to make, and I think that's a pretty remarkable thing. Being funny, making people laugh, you know, it's much, uh, it's a much better gig than having to cry all the time, which I also have to do a lot. The script is so funny, and when it is, you don't have to ad-lib like crazy, but they definitely gave us alternate lines, they definitely gave us the room and the space to try other things, and so I have no idea what will ultimately end up being in the film. This is my first time seeing it, um, but it was a really free and fun and collaborative set. What's so cool about Jen is, like, within two minutes of meeting her, you forget she's a movie star, you know, and you forget she's a Dior model. She's generous and funny and smart and thoughtful you know she's like I'm getting a sandwich do you want a sandwich things like that that you don't necessarily expect like one of the world's most famous people to do um, and she's hilarious she's genuinely funny and game and brave all the things Matthew was hilarious to me I, I, I love him so much and Andrew I've known since he was 16 years old so watching his progression has been like a real honor I think that they're just gonna go fall. We haven't had a lot of comedies where you're just like straight up belly laughing. And look, we've been haven't we been through enough as a as a world? We could just use a little laughter. So that's what I'm hoping that people take away. It was really fun to make it, and uh, Jennifer Lawrence was incredibly good in it. And um, so, and it's R-rated. Seems like a good time for that. I hope. I don't know. I hope it'll be a really great summer movie. I always have liked comedy. I like figuring out how to make a joke better or how to make the timing good or 
how to just how to tell a moment really as perfectly as you can, and and to make each other uh, laugh. You know, I, I enjoy doing it. I enjoy watching other people do it. I hope positively. I think it's uh, really about time we start laughing again together in movie theaters, you know? Um, and, I'm, and I'm excited for people to see it. But he was very nice when I met him, and um, Jen is just the best. She's just uh, delightful. Jean Subnitsky, who uh, I worked with on a show called Trophy Wife a long time ago, so we were old friends, and he asked me to be a part of it. And then I heard Jen was going to be a part of it, and uh, and I was like, how could I say no to this? Sarah, who is uh, uh, Jen's character's best friend in the movie, and you know, we're both, we live in Montauk, we're year-round residents, we don't have as much money as the people who come there for the summer, and we're trying to figure out how to make ends meet. I think it has all the elements, right? It, it kind of has a, a throwback style to it and feel, and um, you know, what, what better place to spend a summer than Montauk. So, you know, it's nice to take the audience there with us. It was very, very loose and very free. Uh, you know, between Gene and Jen, I mean, there's, there's a very just relaxed element to how they work. And, um, you know, we just would try and have as much fun and, and hope the cameras could catch it. But uh, it, was, it was great. And I, th I think Jen's gonna be a big deal. I think she's gonna be a big deal. I think, uh, you know, undiscovered actress here, but I think the world should buckle up. It was pretty tightly scripted by Gene and John, but you, you know they would throw some alts at you, and um, you know that the, the key is just to breathe and go with it. But uh, they they very much had an idea of the film they wanted to make, and and um, you know that's the job is to show up and help them make that. But yeah, I, I think it was pretty tight. But I got to hang out with Andrew in between work days uh, a little bit, and we, we just said, what a nice guy. I mean, just unbelievable. So that was fun. First of all, nothing else is going on this summer, and this is hilarious, okay? It is amazing. I love her, and usually when I get on a set, people don't play with me so much. She played. We had a great time. We had a really, really great time. She's a wonderful girl. I love working comedy because it, it can be off the top of your head sometimes. It's very just clickish, where you know when you got it and it just happens and it just clicks, you know? And it's, it's when you got it, you know it, you know? And it's wonderful. We caught it all on film. Y'all need to check it out. in uh, Jennifer's plan uh, to get Percy. Um, yeah, it's an amazing movie. It's an amazing summer comedy. I'm just honored to be a part of it. Working in comedy is so much fun. You never know what's going to happen. And Gene, the director, is amazing. He lets you do as many takes as you want. Um, which is freeing and it's great and it's it's a comedy you laugh what's better than that I just like that it was just like a like a good time out in Long Island in the summer it was fun weather was nice watching Jennifer it's good I think they'll probably just like laugh a lot I mean it's like a, it's like a silly movie like it reminds me of like Farrelly Brothers movies from the 90s like it just was kind of like really silly and good She's a really game actor, you know, like somebody just told me this is her first comedy. I found that really surprising because she has so much lightness and, and like, and like grace to her, but at the same time she's like willing to fall on her face over and over again. And yeah, I don't know, I think people really like it.
I love laughter. I love laughing at work. I love making people laugh. I, there's no better way to spend your day than writing jokes. I can't imagine a better job in the world. The unique, unique thing is Jennifer Lawrence. I mean, this is her first comedy. Uh, it's not so much. I've done other comedies, but she's special and she's so good in this movie. I am really. I feel like I have a secret that I'm about to unleash to the world. You just have an Academy Award-winning actress. There's no tricks. It's like she knows all the tricks. If I tried a trick, she would know it was a trick. She's much smarter than I am. So uh, no, I just I put. I mean, the camera loves her. She's so good. She's great with physical comedy. She's great with uh, it, with dialogue, with jokes. I mean, she's. It's, it was easy actually. They become like best friends. It's uh, we were having dinner during we were shooting. She's like, oh yeah, I had dinner with Andrew the other day. I was like, what? And, they, and I kind of love that though. I love that they've become friends outside of work. It, it really, I mean, you can see their chemistry on camera. It's amazing.